Hey, how you doing? This is Kitch, and you are watching me play Factorio with Drake Hawkins from the Clan Hawkins channel. How you doing, Drake? Hello, hello. How you doing? I'm doing Not good. Bad. I'm just looking at the beautiful lack of uh, defenses we got up in the northeast. It's, it's pretty. They just keep blasting things up there. I think we have like lack of radar coverage there, and we probably have a bunch of biters there that we just haven't seen yet. I feel like that's probably the case. I'm gonna go up that way and throw in a few radars and see what happens on that east side. Just uh, well, I finally found my uh, blueprint book, and I was comparing it to see if I did it right, and I did it close enough. Wait, you got your uh, blueprints off your off your spot. If you guys like his blueprint. Uh, better than my awesome blueprint collection. I'm, I know, you can say it. We'll let him <laughs> pretend like he's got better ones. Shh, we know mine are better and non-existent. Uh, but no, wait, check out his. Uh, uh, where, where's the link for that? Is that on your? I guess um, be on your. Yeah, on your I, I think I think I may have a link to it in the description of this video, and if not, okay. I will. Well, it's in. I know it's in your blueprint series. Yeah, yeah, it's the so. Kitch's Blueprint book series on my channel. Mm -hmm. And uh, I do know that the uh, the paste bin links work, at least, because I just re-imported them all. <laughs> nice. Yeah, because you couldn't get uh, access to them. Thanks to those friendly... You figured it might be uh, an issue with the mod, right? Yeah, I mean, I, that's that's my best guess. Um, as I was talking to you before, I found a, a number of forum topics on people that were suffering the same problem. Unfortunately, I didn't see any cause or resolution. It was just a whole bunch of people like me asking questions. And, uh, but, uh, yeah, I, I don't know. I've never never had that happen before. As a matter of fact, um, I, I've, I've had blueprints from early days just hanging around in there. Forever. It was probably about due for a cleaning, so it was actually a blessing in disguise. <laughs> it purged your system for you. Yeah, yeah, it was a necessary flush. Sometimes you just gotta let it all go. <laughs> Alright, I am giving us some, so, uh, some radar coverage in various places down here, because it's been a little, a little blind. So yeah, I was wasn't surprised. I'm not surprised to see the slightly lower of uh, biters to the east. You see that? There's a few of them there. Oh wow, they kind of uh, they got a little close, huh? <laughs> oh yeah, they're there. They're not uh, they're not playing around, or they're about to play around with our walls. Actually, I think is what's going to happen. So I'm going to go up there and I'm going to grab this fine fellow. I'm going to say, Biters, come and get me. Where are you at? Where are you at, Biters? Oh, except for I don't have my robo port connected, so I'm probably going to die doing this. There we go. Hey, Biters. Yo. <gasps> ah. uh... Oh, it's not enough of them. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Getting some good lag action going on. Oh, that, that got their attention. Drake's going to run now. Repair, my friendly robots. Repair. The firefight is real. This is like, this is like that. Uh, what's that bug show? The movie. Come on, I gotta remember it. Bug yeah. show. You know the one with the the the, the, the bugs that you know. Man, you're good at this meme things. Um, it's a movie about like. Aliens and bugs. That... Oh, 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 um, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Starship Troopers? Is that what you were? Yeah, that's the one. That's the one. Thank okay. You. That was going to drive me nuts for the rest of this episode. <clears throat> I'm going to do the very exciting tower um, offense here and wipe them out via offense oh, towering. Yeah. World's shortest train. <laughs> Be oh well, it got right? got my uh got got it out of my system. All right, let's see. What's the unloader? Are you the unloader? You're the unloader. Man, large uh, worms don't survive long with with eight turrets firing at them. It's, it's really surprising to think about that, but it's true. Which 
Go jump. Still got the uh, fun lag going on, but I'm learning to deal with it. Uh, at the end of last episode, I started the portable fusion reactor tech. It's pretty going to be pretty exciting. I'm not going to be sad to see that come in. Hmm. I don't suppose. Uh, we must. We must have uh, no high tech science coming out here. <laughs> what? Oh, nothing. Um, oh, you gotta share the goodness. Uh, Some, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm something. gonna move one of these refineries for science. <laughs> Why are you moving the refinery? Uh, because where I built my station, there's not enough room to get the, uh, to get the good stuff through it. All right. <clears throat> but if I just move it down here, it'll be fine. Mm -hmm. Sure. Do all that work. You just <laughs> throw it aside like it doesn't matter. All right. Uh, what is this up here? What, what is this? Big sandy rock. Why is there a big sandy rock? Oh gosh, am I doing this backwards? Stop being damaged. Big sandy rock. Yeah. Right. I haven't refineried in a uh, while. There we go. Listen, bub, don't shoot me. Who do you think you are shooting me? Oh yeah, oh yeah, that's good. That's gonna eat there my face. Go. Come here. Come here. Yeah, that works. Come at me, Rose. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Down to 75% health. Oh, no, I'm out of... Man, okay, so we've actually got... Um... Um... <laughs> it, it adds a little flair, this uh, leg. I, like, placed a, a tower, like in a tower, offensive tower spot. And it took quite a while. Like, the biters are charging at me, and the blueprints haven't reacted. <laughs> the biters know I'm there, but the uh, robots aren't doing anything about it. All right. That is nice. Okay. So all I needed to do there just made me feel better to get rid of those guys. We're not quite ready to upgrade the walls over here. How's that copper in the north? Is it entirely drained yet? Not quite, eh? Eh, yeah, it's got a bit. I love there was a random belt on the iron, uh, iron uh, belt line. A random belt that just was not doing anything. I suppose I could go up and repair the iron field. And the stone. Do I have auto trash for that wood, or is it just taking them that long? Huh. Okay. You have the auto trash? Wood auto trashing? No, I didn't. I guess it's just, uh, it takes our logistics bots a, a little while. I guess we've got very limited robot range, uh, logistics range, and I'm, I'm not, I'm not helping out by, uh, by staying still. I, uh, I'm just doing some iron field repairs. Nothing severely damaged. One, one, well, I guess one was blown up, so that's called, I guess that could be called severely damaged. But for the most part, it's still good, and we're definitely not utilizing this field particularly efficiently. I think everything is definitely bottlenecking on the copper at the moment. If I go clear out a spot for another copper after we get a bit more walls in uh, and let you put in a train station for it. Um, let's see, what did I fuel you with? I don't think I fueled you with anything, so you may not be coming back. Thank you, Drake. Thank you, Drake. 
Are you seeing the stuck in trees? He's not watching where he's walking. Power is actually over 50% now with the new, uh, with the extra solar panels on my backpack. <clears throat> all right, so this time I'm going to make one underground and send all the belts underneath it. <laughs> Last time I was in this situation, I made uh, four underground belts <laughs> and uh, to, go, to, cross to cross one, one. belt, and uh, I got I got called out on it, <laughs> uh, rightfully so. <laughs> I guess you should have done that one, yeah. yeah. It's a legitimate, legitimate uh, query. Okay, you're full already. So, oh, coal. Yeah, you know, that whole coal thing. Without robots to repair this, this corner may be a distinct... Well, I don't think they're going to be able to take it out, to be honest. My concern is that if they take out one of these fuel lines, or one of these... Uh, um flamethrower turrets then they've taken out everything past it on the line because it's not a loop yet oh yeah so there's no no backup once they get one it's done well, there's nothing good um There's no feed to the fuel, other than where, other than coming from the south, from the main line in, input. Once it's fully a loop, though, then it's fine, because they'll cycle back around. All right, so I think we'll, I'll spend the next few minutes just going to head down here and expanding our defenses to the south. Might see about putting another personal robot board on and a few more of these guys because that'd be nice if they could build faster. I don't think my power system will handle it, but once we get uh Oh hi! Oh hi! Don't don't do it no, don't do it! Don't do it, man! There we go. Yeah, you guys don't have much uh, angle on them there, do you? Oh, hi! Mm. That's why we're getting attacked. There's a rather sizable base. Right there. <laughs> I was just building along, ignorant of the fact that I'm running into a base that's got like 30 fighters in it. Or 30 um, spawners in it. Do 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 do. Happy oblivious Drake. That should take care of the base quite nicely. All right. Man, artillery. We did have a problem with copper ore, but it was mostly about coal. So I think I've cinched that one. The copper ore problem was about coal? Well, it, it was a copper ore problem, but it really wasn't a copper ore problem. It was actually a coal problem. Oh. It, it was a coal and a copper ore problem. It was, it was, it was problems. <laughs> you mean there was more than one issue? Going on. Yes, yes. That seems like kind of par for the course. And now I believe they are both solved. And I just lost a couple of biters doing that. Or uh, robots doing that. Not or solved ish, we'll call it. Solved it er. Solved it er. That's a good way to put it. Perfect. Okay, so you it. just need you need you need to go somewhere, Copper. That's where you need to go. So you go in there. I feel like I should probably push that base back. It's maybe a little close.
really, guys, really, we're just like two paces away from being awesome. Is that it? That's the big long one, right? So just give you lots of stuff. I kind of like building these walls when you don't have a logistics network already connecting them because then you don't get the the command to go clear out. Like you don't get some dude flying from the entire opposite side of the map to come. Oh, to come in. Yeah, come yeah, yeah. One piece of wall. Or that one power pole, which is usually the one that the one that connects everything up. Yes. Yeah. You're like five builds further down, and nothing's actually running because some guy's still traveling from across the map and keeps running out of power and having to go back and recharge. But he still got the order. Actually, don't they? I think that cancels the order. All right. And I think it's almost time to turn the line going back into base. Oh, robots. Smelting, smelting with robots. I like smelting with robots. Smelting with robots? What? What does this thing you speak of? Uh, just in, in the in the last series, uh, just having to manually place smelters, it, it becomes tiresome very, oh, very quickly. And uh, just placing down a blueprint and calling it a day is, is very nice. Yeah. Place it and walk away. Okay, now if I just had a million inserters and a million steel furnaces. Uh oh, what's going on here? Don't like this. Mm -hmm. Hitch, you made you made a mess. What'd you break? You guys better tell Oh, just a just a little bit of coal on the steel line. Just a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Twenty biters is or twenty biters. I keep calling them biters. I'm sorry, little robots. 20 robots is so much more fun than, than 10. So okay, it, it, it may actually be a lot of coal on the steel line. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> like, significant amounts of coal on the steel line. <laughs> Obscene quantities of coal are now on the steel line. Um, I feel like if I delete this, it might be bad, but I'm going to do it anyways. Oh, gosh. What are you doing? Did you break some things? Oh, just 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 <laughs> just a couple of things. Okay, where did all that other coal go? Here in the engine line. Because of course it did. And uh oh, all the way down here and into furnaces as well. Wow. Man. Boy, do I know how to mess something up. Well, do it right. I mean, if you're going to do it, do it. Right. If you're going to do it, yeah. Go all the way. All right, well, that it was perfect timing because we just I just ran out of uh, uh, flamethrower turrets just as I reached the finish of the southwest quadrant. And I think I'm going to take this out of here because it'll eventually be removed. And plop them off in the west. And that will be the last one of those uh, flamethrower turrets to go in place. And then we can start deleting lots and lots of stuff. Get rid of the steel. That gets rid of the stone blocks. Now we just gotta get rid of like eight. Just get get a, gotta get rid of like eight things of uh, eight stacks of coal now, <laughs> and we'll be all fixed. We'll just we're just cleaning up the old uh, interior defense line. We have officially expanded our base, claiming our territory. Oh, and I've officially cut off all the power to the oil. That was brilliant. I figured something might be messed up when I start ripping all these lines out, but, you know, 
I didn't see any immediate damage. It's a good thing we got lots of stored oil. Yeah, robots take all that coal away from me. That's that's a good use of your time. Actually, let's not get rid of things. Let's get rid of things that we can get rid of. Okay, my inventory's still a mess, but it's less of a mess than it was. I'm just finishing up the cleanup of the old defenses at the oil. Of course, we have no power running the oil right now, but I'll solve that soon. Where was that line? There should be power. How did I? Oh, man. <gasps> Don't look. Check the flash uh, lights I, in the west. Am I not supposed to look? <laughs> oh, you shouldn't look. It's madly embarrassing. <laughs> there we go. So we're all good now. Uh, power, power poles. What? The entire western hemisphere. Look at that. That's a tree. Trees. So I guess okay. uh, we got a flashing light. We'd probably uh, look to shut things oh, down. Oh yeah, we do, don't we? Or... I was uh, I was I was overly yeah, obsessed with trying to uh, clean out my coal. What's, what's the no something going here? Is this the is this a coal problem? Oh, you've just expanded. Uh, yeah, over there, I just, uh, expanded copper. I ran out of power poles, and I think... Oh, looks like you filled them in. There was just a hole in the way. Uh, except for there's no... Oh, and missing an inserter there. Got her. I think we're connected now. All right, now, uh, copper should be in business again. So where's our logistic... So far. I just fixed this line that you're standing on, which is, oh. of course, not actually feeding anything to anywhere. Where, where is that going? What is it supposed to be? Oh, that's making batteries. No, no, no. No, this is... Blue? Yeah, oh, it's military science. I'm a little confused here. See this line here, beside the science? Am mm -hmm. I mistaken, or does it feed into the opposite side of the blue line? Yeah, that should be military science. What, uh... Where is military science? It's, like, way over here. And, uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's going nowhere. Where should that plug in? That should plug in right here to this one. Uh, should side load into this somehow. Where's, where's the feed of it? It stops right up here. Oh, okay, yeah, and then it has to side load onto this belt here. We could bring it down anywhere. I mean, we could feed it like whatever. Uh, yeah, exactly. That thing. But he said, which side do we need to load onto? We need it going bottom for me, so it needs to come onto the this side. So... Yeah. That side? Yeah. Oh, okay. I, I, see, I see what you're doing there. Yeah. We fixed it twice. Yeah, there we go. That, that works. That works. That looks good. Right. Looks good. 
Uh, possibly why the portable fusion reactor tech is not running. It is. <laughs> that that may that be That was it. the actual problem. <laughs> Everything else is backed up. I'm looking at this thinking, one of these things is missing. Ah, but we do have noticed. copper again. Yay! Kind of. Copper. There we go. Love it. Yeah. You have some reason. Things are building stuff. Sort yeah. Of. Yeah, that was uh, like three episodes ago. I was wanting to get uh, some more, some more red sign, uh, red circuits, and uh, finally got it. <laughs> red, red circuits are probably uh, need a little bit more. Uh, probably need some priority splitters on this uh, bus coming down because we have a full copper belt here going to nowhere, and a full one coming down here to nowhere. But you know, it gives us something to do in the next episode. It's a. You stay up here with these two. So they'll shuffle everything down to, from my perspective, to the right side. Right? Ah, uh, yeah. I mean, yeah, um, that's... if there's something go to go somewhere, which there isn't. But these are red belts feeding into a... They're yellow belts, and the two the two on the left are yellow belts feeding in. They'll feed it. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, it works. It fills it. Backs up the line gonna be copper is, is is feeding the gonna like if we don't, don't make red circuits without green so we might as well have them prioritized yeah yeah like the and it looks like it's backing up. up yeah it's backing up it's just gonna take them a while to to get caught up they're feeding all all it's actually they're just about just starting to get this last that is now feeding too so we're back up to our. Was that? We're back up to zero. So. <laughs> mm -hmm. I like how you added these uh, coppers in here. I've never noticed that before. The instead of feeding the copper ahead, you actually you just use the same line. Yeah, just use the same line. I've been uh, been playing with that a little bit, uh, and it's you know, a lot easier than running two lines. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you don't need it, right? It's the, the bottleneck is going to be your. Your cables. So. You can't Anyways. run it as far. You can't expand it as far, but eh, you know, you you, you can always make a new row. <laughs> yeah, well, you you're gonna run out, but right. Yeah. You, know, you really, it's not that top priority at this point. But uh, there's some technology we just finished. It's gonna make me very happy someday. Once I have 250 blue processors in the inventory. Uh, there's a box right here. Oh, that is. has 500 in it. Excuse me. Can I have those? Thank you. Bye bye. <laughs> Lovely. It'll be like a bazillion hours to finish. Oh no, they're actually not that bad. They're only a 10 second build. There you go. That's a good way to go. Is it my outro here? Yes, it is. There you go, sir. You have power for it. Portable oh, fusion. look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. We're high oh, tech now, guys. We are high tech. Okay, I, I need to space? I need to remember that I have that in the next episode. Oh no, I can I can fit it just just like that. Bam. There we go. All right. We're yeah. we're, we're in business. Yeah. I just I just bammed too and I'm very happy to see it. <laughs> look at that. Now I can put my night vision back on. If I probably threw it away somewhere. I did. I threw it in the logistics chest somewhere. Great. All right, well, that's where we're going to put it up for today. We will be back again with some more fun for you guys. Now that we've got, uh, you know, better powers, better tech, and our science is run or our circuits are running again. Things are on the move. So we got uh, trains, we got lasers, we got all sorts of things going on. Thanks for joining us. Uh, hit the like button if you're still enjoying the series. Thank you so much, and we love the comments. Keep them coming. And as always, see you in game.